what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Mushroom bringing you guys another video. I know we don't have Fortnite on screen right now, but I wanted to bring you guys this video early in the morning. It is literally 7-11 in the morning, guys. I promise you, like I kid you not, it is stupid early in the morning right now. But with that being said, I just wanted to bring you guys this video because there is some new skins coming to Fortnite Battle Royale and there's a theory that I have. So I'm going to show you guys on screen right now. These are some of the skins coming to Fortnite Battle Royale. While my game updates, as you guys can see, we're on 57%. You probably can't even see it, but we're almost there. So while the game is updating it, I'm going to show you guys the gingerbread skin and stuff like that. I want to show you guys these new skins that are coming to Fortnite Battle Royale. So this kind of this kind of proves that maybe we might get lucky with Fortnite not re-releasing uh, the Nutcracker. The um, I, I actually think they're going to bring the gingerbread, the Merry Murder skin back. But not the Nutcracker, maybe the Elf guy. They might not bring these skins back. And that is because, guys, we only have like two more weeks left in Christmas. And they're dropping all these brand new skins, as you guys can see. And we're going to talk about that here in a second. These skins take probably, maybe it'll take two weeks, a week and a half to to basically put these in the item shop because they like to update update the item shop every like two days or something like that so these skins will be in the item shop for two days and with all these skins it's going to cover about like seven days until we get brand new skins so maybe towards the end when christmas time is actually here they'll start dropping the the old og skins but who knows we, we don't know if that's happening don't don't forget that on halloween they only released the skull trooper and then they brought a new skin to the game which was the female skull trooper they did not re-release the nog ops or anything like that so maybe they're not going to re-release every single skin for the holiday but some of the ones that they are releasing are these ones so fortnite version 7.10 leaked cosmetic skins pickaxes backlings gliders and emotes so these are two of the skins right here um who cares about the ads okay so skins at the time of writing visual assets such as images mo models um and and animations are mostly unavailable due to anti-data mining techniques in place by Epic. So if you guys don't know, if you want to know basically what this means, Epic Games changed something around in their coding so that way data miners cannot find the skins but as you guys can see we actually were able to find it you can't you can't beat the hackers man the computer nerds the geeks they're out there typing in going into the game files and stuff like that you're not going to be able to hide things from them they're really good at what they do but with that being said so this is the frozen raven skin this is a legendary skin this is probably going to be a skin that you're gonna have to buy that's an additional to the raven now this could be if you have the raven skin just an upgraded version of it like you could change your style within the skins this might be one of the versions where you can actually change the style style of your raven skin if they do that that'll be sick because one it saves me money two it's just going to be an extra additional skin that i have in the game so next up we have the frozen red knight legendary now this one if they release this one and as like a customizable skin additional to the red knight this is going to be a rare skin because again the red knight skin was only released in i believe season two battle pass so not everyone has this actually no you know what that was the dark knight so this one could be re-released as well this one won't be that rare of a skin but it is a legend area as well frozen red knight looks pretty cool i like i like the raven skin a little bit better than the red knight and then we have the frozen love ranger skin which is a legendary as well this one looks pretty cool just because he looks like he's glowing like these ones they just look like they're a little frostbitten and stuff like that they just they got icicles on them but this guy he just he looks like he's see-through he's glowing and stuff like that so that might be the move okay so our, our fortnite is ready to go so we're going to open that here in a second and then we have a prodigy which they cannot find the files for a maven skin which they can't find the files for and then they have the tinsel toes tinsel toes i think that's what it said this is one of the female skins coming to the game of fortnite and then this one right here the cloaked shadow which is an epic skin this one this is one of the crazy ones i don't know what this means it's kind of a weird skin because it's like got red and then he's like dark with horns i don't know what it means um it doesn't really remind me of anything christmas spirit like but then again i could be wrong let me know down in the comments below what you guys think so the pickaxes at the time they have no images of the pickaxes and back blings there's only like two of them so the frozen love wings I guess this is like a laptop. It's called the Teak Techie Rare. It's a boot up laptop. And then the Bird Shot, which is a legendary backlink as well. But, and then they have other ones that we can't really see images of yet during the making of this video. But guys, with that being said, let's go ahead and open up Fortnite Battle Royale so we can try to see the actual Gingerbread Man skin looks like. I know you guys probably seen videos and stuff like that on Twitter. But again, I just want to bring you guys this video because it's early in the morning. The skin stuff just dropped and I wanted to bring you guys this video because I haven't done a video like this in a long time. And back in the day, I used to do these all the time anytime there's a new update and stuff like that so i wanted to bring it to the channel to see if you guys enjoy it if you guys actually like me uploading early videos to keep you guys up to date with new skins coming to the game so okay so now okay so as you can see it since i already have the skin it says one of your cosmetic items now included additional items hope you enjoy so we have the smiley face 
Um, we have the burnt face. He looks a little mad. This is, yeah, the burnt frown face. And then we have the burnt happy face, which they're both burnt the same. One's just mad and one's happy. I don't like the happy. The smile is way too big on the happy. It kind of looks fake. The mad one, he looks, he looks tough. I like the mad one. And then I think that's it. So that's all the ones that we have. We got a new back bling, which is pretty cool. It's the gingerbread. And I think, oh, we got a new back bling. Cosmetic items now back bling. Okay, cool. So that one came with it for free. Bird shot. I don't know what the bird shot's for. Maybe the bird shot is for the, oh, for the crack shot. Okay, so we have the crack shot. And then we have the bird shot back bling that came with it. So this is the back bling that's supposed to come with the crack shot, which is the bird shot. It makes sense. It makes sense. This crack shot skin... I hope they don't re-release it. I love the skin so much as a rare skin. Not that many people loved it back in the day. So we have the gingerbread man so we can edit the styles. Um, we have all these different styles unlocked. I'm definitely going to go with the fr burnt frown face. And then we got to use the back bling, the new back bling that came with it. Okay, so this is basically the new skin. I mean, it looks pretty cool. Honestly, oh, cool. The arm's like burning still, as you can see. That's pretty cool, man. I actually really like it. The, the back bling kind of ruins it. So we're going to go ahead and try and just put a sword on it. Just because, I mean, you can't have like half of it burnt and then the back bling is completely intact. So we're going to go into a game because I want to show you guys real quick. Actually, I'll go to playgrounds because I want to show you a few changes within the map. Super quick, but they, they are pretty cool changes that I know some of you guys want to see. Okay, so first things first we're i mean it looks normal everything looks the same um the block the block is different i believe uh there's actually stuff there at the block so we're gonna fly over polar peak we're gonna go check out polar peak because that's one of the first things that i wanted to show you guys actually since we're close to the block and there's a rift here we're gonna go ahead and go to the block oh wait it looks like nothing is at the block which is weird because i'll show you guys right now on twitter okay since there's nothing at the block we're gonna go to polar peak but I'll show you guys on Twitter right now real quick. Right here, as you guys can see on screen right now, the block has updated with today's patch. Drop to the block and explore the newest community creation. Get lost in the mysterious uh, mysterious grimy greens factory made by someone else. So this is the image right now on screen, as you guys can see. Let me go ahead and save this image, and then I'll, I'll, I'll make it a bigger file so that way you guys can actually see it. So as you guys can see, I pulled it up on screen right now. This is, this is basically what it's supposed to look like. It's got like, I don't know, it's a fan-made thing that they brought to the block, which is it looks pretty cool they got greens everywhere um so it's gonna have a lot of wood here they got brick walls so it's gonna have a lot of brick and i see cars everywhere else so there's gonna be cars there as well that's that's supposed to be the new risky reels oh cool we landed at polar peak so as you guys can see if you don't remember polar peak this is where the uh, actual sword was oh it's funny how they put this iceberg here now so that way the sword, if it does spawn here, because they were having problems with the sword spawning here, if it does spawn here, you can't get to it. So this this castle now is something completely different. As you guys can see, it, it's an actual castle. It looks good. It's not just a big tower. And once you come inside, it's like a huge throne, which is really cool. Like this, this looks freaking awesome there's chests everywhere there's chest there chest there chest there now these chests might not always spawn here but these are just some of the chest locations but so that's pretty cool let me see what it actually looks like though with f like the settings all the way up on this thing okay so with all the settings all the way up this holy crap okay it's a little laggy all right there we go we're good we might have to turn the brightness default values at 50 oh my goodness this is this is pretty crazy i mean everything's glowing i love the way things glow so there's a chest here and then we can come back here. And there's a chest back here as well. This looks freaking sick, man. This, this, oh my god, look at the floor. It's all shiny and nice. This looks really cool, man. Honestly, it does. I like this place. I don't normally play with my, my settings this high. Oh my gosh, everything here looks so cool. Playing with your settings all the way up is actually really cool. Another cool thing that has changed is if you come over to Tilted Towers or any of the big cities, I don't know if you guys played Fortnite uh, back last year when uh, Christmas was going on and stuff like that, but they have Christmas trees supposedly placed all around the map. Now, there used to be one right here, I believe, in the center, but it looks like it's not there anymore. So we're going to respawn again, and we're going to go to like Salty Springs or Retail Row or something like that. I'm kind of upset that uh, the block isn't really updated. I don't know if it's not updated in playground or if i have to go to an actual game um but if you guys go to the block you might see that it is updated to something completely different and there's supposed to be christmas trees here at this uh at these oh yeah, yeah see the christmas trees right here right here in the center of a uh, retail row as you guys can see back then last season they had chests three chests that spawned around it but now they don't have a chest they just have normal drops i guess the this is like the presents not open and stuff like that so you'll find loot underneath the tree so as you guys can see 
there's loot under the tree so we don't have to open up chests or anything like that we could just do that which is pretty cool now i'm gonna go back to my normal settings real quick now in case for some of you guys that might may ask why do you like your setting speed like like that like not as good quality and uh the brightness to be up a little bit higher that's because when the settings are like this there's no shadows so i can actually see inside buildings and stuff and i can see across the map a little bit farther with my settings a little bit lower because it, it raises my fps a little bit higher as well but guys with that being said that is the end of the video if you guys please can give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends please the more likes we get the more that i know you guys enjoy these early videos and i'll see you guys in the next video peace